Roman Atwood is an American comedian, prankster, vlogger, and film director who was born and raised in Millersport, Ohio, the very same state where he still lives to this day, just in a more impressive house which we'll look at. Roman has been producing videos since he was in high school when he began his independent career by creating a series of DVDs called The Nerd Herd, which he then took to Warp Tour in 2006 to sell and build up his audience. <laughs> Atwood stuck close to home after his education and split his time between working at his family's rope factory and working on various film projects and commercials around the Columbus, Ohio area before deciding to focus on his passion for creating comedy content for YouTube on a channel dubbed Sketch Empire in late 2009. When's that pizza getting here? I'm so hungry I could eat Sarah Jessica Parker. Relax, John. The pizza will be here, man. It's just pizza. Yeah, go make yourself some popcorn if you're so hungry, John. <sighs> And bring back the rest for us, fatty. Get your back off, Gray. He's got a disease, man. Hey, thanks, Roman. You're welcome. Hey, one more thing. Hey, remember to wring your armpits over that popcorn. You guys know I love that butter. <laughs> Fast forward to 2018, and Roman married his second wife, Brittany, in Maui, Hawaii. What are you doing? Getting our pictures from today? What is that? Wait, seriously? Are you married? At this point, Roman already had a son, Noah, from a previous marriage, and in 2011, he and Brittany had their first son, Kane, followed by their daughter, Cora, in 2017. Over the years, Roman has built up a vast legion of fans and has more than 25 million subscribers spread across two different YouTube channels. Roman Atwood was his first channel and dedicated to pranks, but it hasn't been updated in over four years. While Roman Atwood Vlogs specializes in personal entries that examines the Atwood family life on a regular basis. Got anything out there? There's a black and white cat. What is it? Gotta go get Noah. What is it? What is all that? <laughs> Baby ones. For you? Yeah. Okay, go get Noah up. If you've ever seen one of Roman's videos, then you probably already have a pretty good idea of what his house in the outskirts of Columbus looks like. After all, it's pretty heavily featured in most of his content. But just in case you aren't familiar with the insane home he's got, and I mean just wait till you check out the backyard of this place. I'm gonna tell you all about it today. What's happening guys and girls? It's Kara here for you with a new house tour, this one taking a look at the home of Roman Atwood and his famous family. He and Brittany took a long break from YouTube, like more than half a year, leaving fans wondering where they went, but it seems they're back full force on the platform. Oh, and they're expecting another baby. Hey, Rowan! Brittany, if you're watching this video, I just want to say hi, big fans. Kara's pregnant as well. I'm not. Despite the fact that Romans posted videos claiming to move to a new home, they've usually just been clickbait and not actually a new house. However, the Atwood family home is about as nice as they come and perfect for the continually growing family. Today I'm going to give you all the deets on the place you can see for yourself. We've also done house tours and likes of the Graffiti Mansion and David Dobrik's new mansion and we'll link to some at the end. Don't forget to like, subscribe and follow me on Instagram if you want to chat. Now let's get into this video. Roman first bought this home back in 2014 for a reported $349,000. And once you take a look at this place, I'm pretty sure you'll agree with me that that was a huge deal. Let's start by taking a look at the exterior. Out front, there's a whole ton of open space. In fact, the home is extremely isolated and has ample room all around the property. Not long after moving in, Roman constructed a whole new backyard space that must have set him back more than he even paid for the property in the first place. It's really hard to put into perspective of what this is going to be and what it's gonna look like even to me I'm like how's this gonna turn in so it's just mayhem however I can guarantee the vlogs will never be the same like this is going to be the zone to be in like this is gonna be the spot all right guys here is a pretty good look at what's going on Ariel it is just crazy like my yard like I want you guys to remember this man this this backyard is 
is gonna be different. Roman installed a huge recreational area out front that's surrounded by a white picket fence where his kids can go and play all day long if the mood strikes them. While out back, there's a massive wraparound dock that makes for a ton of entertaining space. But the best feature of this entire property is a lakefront it boasts back here, where Roman has set up what must be one of the most amazing water slide getups in the history of the Bible Belt. That was awesome, dude. Dude, that was good. That was a good one. <laughs> Whoa! Oh my gosh! <laughs> There's so much open space in and around the property that Roman even has industrial equipment parked around just waiting on standby in case he needs to use it for content creation. I mean, what else are you gonna do with a giant school bus other than this? When you're trashing a school bus on your very own property, I think that's a clear sign that you've got it made. Seriously, the place has got it all. I mean, the only thing it's missing outside is some farm animals. Wait, they have that? Give me an example of what I'm talking about. Step number one, crazy. Flash, covered in mud. Donkey, just chilling, hanging out. He's crazy, you know? You're covered in mud too. Well, would you look at that? They've even got themselves a donkey. All right, let's move on to the inside. Exact details like square footage hasn't been leaked, but what I can tell you is that Roman's home has two bathrooms and three bedrooms, including a couple of fun kid-inspired rooms for the youngsters. What do you see yourself doing in 10 years? Oh my. Um... You'll be 22. Stop. Dude, my boy is gonna be 22 in 10 years. 22? You're not allowed to be 22. When you enter the front door, you're immediately greeted by a stairway that leads up to the top floor. Besides the bedrooms upstairs, there's also an open space at the top of the steps that makes for a perfect family room where the kids can goof around with toys and never be too far from their parents' eyes. Downstairs, the kitchen and living room are combined together in an open concept style space. If you look up while standing in the living room, you can see the balcony to the upstairs that encircles the family room. Since moving in, Roman has added a number of features to the living room, including a wall-mounted aquarium and a whole ton of equipment for roughhousing with the kids. The kitchen has a gigantic island situated in the middle of it and has a ton of cabinet space as well as top-of-the-line stainless steel appliances. But most importantly, like every other room in the place, there's a ton of space for non-cooking related activities. That being said, the biggest takeaway from the Atwood house is definitely all of that open space, and I mean it makes sense. After all, Roman films the vast majority of his content from this location, and you've just gotta have room for all types of stunts when it comes to what Roman likes to do. Even if that means installing your very own indoor rock climbing wall in your living room. Wait on this and go up. Now go up to the yellow. Yeah, boy. Grab up. <laughs> He needs a foothold right here. Dude, Watch you're a scaler. Here. Yeah, one more in the middle there. But perhaps the most remarkable thing about this home is that it's such a fan favorite, it even wound up making its way into the video game Minecraft. Considering the types of stunts that Roman puts on this property on a regular basis, this might be one of the few occasions where something is way more fun in real life than it is in a video game. I think we'll bring this video to an end here. What did you guys think of Roman Atwood's house tour? Is there anything about the home that you guys know that I forgot to mention? Let me know in the comments below. And link me to some of your favorite Roman Atwood stay at home pranks. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram to continue the conversation and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.